Hey, I thought I'd start off Muso May with something I probably would inevitably get asked to play, <laughs> even though I'm definitely really burnt out on this game. Uh, I did have one person vote, and uh, that person mentioned that they wanted me to play this and Fire Emblem, so I already recorded the Fire Emblem video, but I'm going to go ahead and do this one first. So I'm just going to play as Ling Tong for a bit. Uh, I'm not really a fan of the siege weapon changes that they made. They kind of just turned me off playing the game completely. But I definitely got my money's worth out of this. And for what it's worth, it, it, it seems like they may have actually finally dropped support. Uh, I have been checking the Steam database for this, and uh, they haven't made any like changes to the branch at all. The only thing they've really done is things like... Uh, like change some of the the websites and stuff on the page. They may have actually stopped supporting this game, which I think is pretty interesting. I mean, people do still want content for it, but I think at this point they may be deciding to just cut their losses and move on. I've always been a firm believer that they have been decloning all these characters even though no one's really buying the DLC just to reduce the workload for later, <laughs> but maybe they decided that it got to the point where that's not even really worth doing anymore. They are supposed to be getting some kind of big announcement regarding uh, Dynasty Warriors at some point this year. Uh, there was something in Famitsu a couple months ago at the end of last year about how there's supposed to be like some major change up in the franchise or something. I don't really know what that's going to be. hope it's not like Battle Royale or something. <laughs> I am totally not down for that. game still runs badly on my computer too. Well, it won't run well until I get it upgraded because it's so poorly optimized. So that's another reason why I've kind of moved on to other stuff. I don't know what it is about this game that makes it run so bad. I don't know what computers they had to, like, <laughs> test this game on, but my computer should be more than enough for a game like this. And I have to constantly turn down the settings. And I personally just got really tired of it. A lot of the other games I play run fine. It's really only this one that gives me significant problems. At least out of the things that I play regularly on the channel. I have tried everything. I've fought with it so much, and it's just not worth the stress anymore. It doesn't really seem like too many people are interested in this game anymore. Which is understandable. They've definitely gone overboard with the DLC and some people don't like that. I was just burnt out on the game to begin with and then they added the, uh, the siege weapon thing and that just kind of made me want to move on. But I do still like playing it sometimes. It's nice to go back to this. I haven't played this in like a month. Now, sometimes when you're tired of something, and you're really burnt out, sometimes you just stop and play some other stuff and you appreciate it again. I'm actually having fun playing this right now. I've just had to be careful with my stress levels and stuff to not get to the point where I'm forcing myself to play things anymore, because I did that for a long time, and it's just not really a healthy uh, habit to have. I gotta wait for him to get out of here. Every single time I turn on this game, I can't get something where I just fight an officer. It's always gotta be this this gimmick stuff. He's still all the way over here. Come on, dude, just run past them.
Is he still not out here? Really? <laughs> Come on, dude. Twenty years of making this game, there's never just a command to just tell them to just run past the enemies. You have to clear the path, like, entirely before the AI will stop trying to pathfind them. Alright, he's getting there slowly. <laughs> he's taking a sweet time. Come on, dude, just run past them. It's not rocket science. Ah, oh, there's all these guys over here that keep respawning, and he won't just run past them. Standard Muso fashion, he runs, like, as slow as humanly possible, too. I can't be bothered to, like, give them a speed buff. Clear these guys out so he won't get stuck again. I don't know, your luck was pretty good. I mean, he was stuck in like an army of like 20 peons. You couldn't figure out how to get past them. He's supposed to be like a battle-hardened warrior. And 20 peons who don't attack was too much for him to handle. So, I think Zhou Yu, your, your luck has not run out. I do plan to get a 2060, uh, maybe in the summer, depending on how things go. They are still kind of expensive right now, but looks like the summer is going to be relatively barren for me, so I, I do plan on doing that at some point. I'm sure maybe then I'd be able to run this at a locked 1080p 60, but <laughs> I'm already burnt out, so it's too little too late. Alright, that's a boat level, so that's not happening. Let's just go straight to the battle. You didn't do shit, man. You stood there and talked. <laughs> what the hell did you do, buddy? <laughs> if they really have drop support for this game, I do think they left it in a, a pretty respectable state. 
Well, obviously, they could decone more characters and stuff, but the game's already got, like, $150 in DLC. I think they maybe they realized yeah, yeah. it <laughs> and wasn't really doing the game much good to keep oh. supporting it. I'd like to be wrong, but normally they, they would have put out another patch right now. Um, obviously, Golden Week kind of complicates things because they don't do any work at all for a week, but even then, they, they have not done anything since, and it's been a couple weeks since uh, Golden Week ended. So it is possible that uh, maybe they are finally done supporting this. I think it's been almost a year and a half. It's been a year and uh, about three and a half months now that they've been supporting this game. And that they haven't supported anything else as long as they have this, so I hope that we'll continue to get the support for their future titles. Now, also, oh, this is a Siege one, so I'm not doing that. Now, also, I hope their other games launch in a better state than this, but regardless, I think it was awesome. You know, it was fun to log on to this game every month and see what they changed, and you know, some things didn't turn out that great at first. Sometimes they got better later on, like the raid bosses and things. But they definitely uh, made this game a lot better. It's a shame that people never really gave it another chance. But that's kind of the problem with releasing games in a broken state. And uh, every major publisher is doing that now. It doesn't matter how much you fix something. If it releases in a really bad state, you can't really expect people to come back. And I kept coming back because it was always fun to just play this when there was nothing else of note happening. But not everybody has that time and patience, so it's understandable that a lot of people never really got to see how much this game improved over the past year and three and a half months. I think people are still a little bit too harsh on it. There's definitely a lot of things I hate about this game I've talked about at length before, but... They definitely put in a good effort to try and fix it. I just did Fire Emblem and One Piece from Uso May before I did this, so I'm definitely appreciating the grappling hook right now. <laughs> It's one of those things you don't appreciate till it's gone. Shotai having fun uh, running in circles here. Yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, eat so, alright. Come on, hurry up, dude. <laughs> I'll talk. Just said let's go, so let's go. I wanna see him get bodied by these bulbs, that would be glorious. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and stop there. Just thought I'd play this for a little bit. I am still very burnt out on it. I don't know if they have drop support. Uh, I'll go ahead and link to their uh, SteamDB page in the description. It seems like they have uh, finally stopped supporting the game, but maybe we'll hear an announcement soon. Overall, I, I definitely had fun with this game. I, I didn't have fun with all the people shit posting and <laughs> posting really nasty comments and stuff. That's one reason why I kind of distanced myself from this game, but it is still very fun to play sometimes, so I'll try to come back when I can. Thanks for watching. Peace.